Okay, this is part two to the chariots of Israel. Um, all right, I didn't get to enough details here. So I left off saying as the two go by, as the white goes by the black, you have an eclipse, if you will, aka the sun turning dark. When does that happen? It happens right here. Anytime there's a land, again, you see that? Anytime, once after they peak, they're going down. That's the black horse going down where you're going up for the children of Israel. You see that? So, again, these are the bottomless pits. Why do you think with the fifth trumpet, the locusts come out from the bottomless pit and smoke arises and turns the sun dark? Think about it, right? Great smoke of the great burn, and the sun and the air were darkened. That's why, and then you see it in Revelation, the sun and the moon, or the sun going dark, moon turning red. I mean, there's more to it, but that's what, at a very base level, granted, there's a million different ways to look at it, but this is a very deep, deep level. The, again, the sun, when the smoke arises, so that's the, again, the fifth trumpet, day five, if you will, is the locust beings make the sun dark and the sun goes down. Again, the sun is related to gold and alchemy, so they are, they're, they want this sun. They're going directly toward it, okay? They're trying to make gold, aka, that's what 666 has to do with it too, is they're being male, there's only one male. So they're trying to make gold themselves. And they try to shoot up to get that gold again. Why do you think this sky's blue? Is that's the law? Okay, that's why in the sixth trumpet, again, like I said, okay, so then this is, again, this would be one, for them, this would be one, two, three, four, and then five, six, fall again. Again, this is Babylon, the one through five. Okay, one through five is Babylon or the sea beast. Six and seven, five, six, seven is a land beast. That would be either antitypical Persia, Rome, or United States, okay? So, as that's happening, again, the smoke from the bottomless pit is created, making the sun dark because they think that, again, they have brass. They think it's real gold. It turns, actually, the sun turns dark. It's eclipsed by the moon, the church, the woman with the moon on her feet, and she's rising again. And it turns black. That, again, Jesuit logo. It's the black sun. It's, that's why it has its black, right? Yes, some people actually within that cult know exactly what this is, but most don't. They're deceived, but very much so. They're beyond redemption at that point. But So they're going down, and they, they stay down. They turn to iron. You see that? Their brass, their fool's gold, their brass is turning to iron. Why do you think Nebuchadnezzar's tree was cut down, bound with bands of iron and bronze? Right? So seven times passed over him. Again, these could be the seven times. One, two, oh, I have to count the hollows number because that's the uh, when the image is formed. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right? Okay. I know some people try to turn this into like a 2520, which I, I've seen and I don't really see much in it. But I think the seven times, if you look at it that way, it makes way more sense to me. But anyway. So, back to Revelation we go. So basically, that's what I'm trying to say is, is the smoke from the bottomless pit is the locust coming up. That's either Islam, back in the day, or antitypical United States. It's turning, they're turning into iron and falling down. So that would be right here or right here. They're turning into iron. That's why you can see there's a mixture of bronze and iron, iron, bronze and iron. See that? Re pure bronze, iron and bronze. Pure iron, iron and bronze. Pure bronze, that's what's going on, right? They're, they're out amalgamating them, right? So as this is falling down, again, we're going to say it's right here. So that's trumpet five. That's where the sun is turning dark from the locusts or the smoke from the bottomless pit, they're gonna fall down to the bottom. What are they gonna do? They're gonna try to make an image again. They're gonna take the two pillars of church and state 
and they're going to form them and they're going to go for sit five six seven again it's going to be the same thing except the last one's different because that's when the little return happens so the cycle is going to be cut off time is cut short for the sake of the elect right so again so then they fall down to the bottom this is one through four so one two actually from their perspective they go backwards remember so one two three four that's the four horsemen Ooh, something else I wanted to just point out real quick. Why do you think these four horsemen are synonymous with the four plagues, fourth seal? Notice the four the plagues that are given. The four of them. It's sword. Where's my other chart? Where'd it go? Anyway, okay, here it is. Plagues are sword. Beast, okay, it's sword, famine, pestilence, beast. Okay, that's sword, that's famine, pestilence, plagues, or sickness, beast system. Okay, so these are all, so that's what I'm saying is there's two ways of looking at it. So are you going to look at it from a judgment perspective or from our perspective, right? So again, they go this way, like that. They're going reversed, like I have right here. So that's why, and you can follow this through. It's very obvious once you know, once you see this. Why do you think the first seals, um, like actually, I'm gonna go to the trumpets. Why do you think they're poured out on the land and then the sea? Talk about the first one. The bowl was poured out. Actually, where's my other chart? Okay, the bowl was poured out on the land. See that? The earth, that's land. So that would be right here. Or depending on where you want to start the cycle. Oh, let's go back to the literal. Okay, that'd be Rome, dry land. That's the first one. That's day one. Day two, well, I'll keep it simple because I already have the numbers. Okay, that's one. Day two or second trumpet. Great mountain burning. Okay, a lot of people say that was pagan Rome. Fell burning into the sea. You see that? That's the sea. That's day two. And the waters were struck. You see that? Third, water struck again are the rivers. Okay, this is also likened to a river. Think of a Euphrates, if you will. Okay. Fourth, the sun was struck. What do we say? Number one, two, three, four. Or going backwards, one, two, three, four. The sun was struck. You see that? So their peak, then the sun was struck. Makes perfect sense, right? And then the bottomless pit's opened, and it further darkens it again, so then they fall to the bottom. They're gonna try this again, so then they're gonna go this way. They're going backwards, and then they're gonna try to go, they're gonna create their image, so that's now antitypical. That's Babylon falling. This is United States or Persia, depending on how you will. That's Esther's death decree or the hollow. And they create an image, and they do it again. So that's why there's, again, this this little cycle again. It's going back up. You see that? So now, see, you're crossing, you're going from land, passing through the waters, getting on dry land, right? So I hope this is making perfect sense now. So then they go five, six, happens again. Why do you think the sixth trumpet? Uh, they're bound at the four, okay. I believe, maybe it's the sixth plague. I believe the um, sun goes dark again here. But regardless, there's smoke arising. So I want to talk about the three, the um, fire, smoke, rips. Actually, in my last video, I actually said that there's iron in this one. I meant to say I misspoke that there was not. I was thinking of there's lions. There's, there's lion heads here, lion heads here. That's what I was thinking about. There is not iron here. In fact, when it talks about their idols, where, if they were going to mention any idols, they would mention iron. They did not repent of the works of their hands. They should not worship demons of idols of gold, silver, brass, stone, and wood. Why did they skip over iron? There's no iron in the sixth. Why is that? Again, five, six. It's going from that amalgamation of brass and iron. Remember, we talked about this last time, how they had something like gold, that's brass, and then they had breastplates of iron. So it's going from that amalgamation, AK when the six starts, and it's going into 
brass and there's no iron. You see that? So again, they're going to try that again. So this is five and six. They're going to try to climb the peak again. They're going to fall short. See what's going on? So then the three, I said this before, I think are synonymous with the three ribs in the Persian bear mouth, the three kingdoms. If you wanted to say the remaining three, so then the Persian bear had the one, two, three, if you want to look at it like that. Either way, fire, smoke, and brimstone. Also, it says hackinth blue. If you look up the word, some people say it's blue, like the red, white, and blue on the American flag, or sulfur, off-white color, or they say it's a dark red. Either way, it's pretty obvious that it becomes fire, smoke, and brimstone. See what I'm saying? So the red, blue, and sulfur yellow become fire, smoke, and brimstone. Again, the sun's turning dark again. You see that? So as this is, again, this is what's going on. So then they go five, six, and then they fall down again. Why? They're trying to breach the, the firmament. Again, if you're a flat earther, you know exactly what this is. Why is the sky blue? It's because of law right? They're trying to get up and they keep falling down. They're trying to get to the sea of glass above, right? So the fire, smoke, and brimstone have to do, the red is if you don't accept the sacrifice of Yeshua, Jesus, you become the sacrifice, okay? It's like the sword, pestilence, and famine and beast system. Again, those four judgments I'm getting from um, Ezekiel. Actually, it's in it's in um, uh, Leviticus too. When you transgress, you're going to get the four. You're going to get the famine, pestilence, sword, and beast system. Okay. Again, those are the uh, synonymous with the four horse as well. Okay. So they get the red. That's the blood. And if they reject this this sacrifice, they become the sacrifice. Okay. They reject the law, Sunday law, changing one of the Ten Commandments. They reject the law. What is the penalty of the law? Death. You see that? That's why it's blue. You see that? So they're rejecting the law and they're, they're falling. That's the falling down. So they're falling down. Okay, that's transgression of the law. Then the smoke is actually sulfur yellow. And if you get, if you look up, oh, where did I have it? Um, I'll have to do another one where I show you guys that the um, what they have on certain charts. They have um, the backward system. This is actually yellow. But it's the, oh, let me put it this way. It's the false messiah. It's the off-white color. You see that? It's, it's, so this is, this would be in the east. So they're riding, instead of riding the true white horse northbound, they're riding a false messiah. They're becoming their own. AKA they're becoming their own male. Watch my other videos, right? And that's why fire and smoke and brimstone was synonymous with the destruction of Sodom and Gomorrah because they're all male, right? Makes perfect sense. So they ride it up again on the between five, six, they ride it up and the sulfur falls down. See that? Fascinating. Again, I could speak for hours on this stuff. Crazy. I might have to, again, I might have to do another part to this.